Hi guys, today we are going to charity shops. And yeah, we're gonna do a bit of shopping, a bit of thrifting, and I'm really excited because I haven't been for so long. I know the unspoken rule about going to charity shops is you need a good outfit, and I'm really just not giving that today. She's really, really basic. She's like disgustingly basic, but it's okay, it's fine, let's go. I don't know why I decided it'd be a good idea to not to wear a coat. I think I just want it to be summer so bad, I'm just gaslighting myself that it's hot. The first charity shop isn't usually my favorite one to go to because the prices are quite high for what it is but something I do love about it is that they do really good records and I just love like the DVD section I think it's so cool the next charity shop I don't really go in too much but it was nice to have a good look around like I did see some things that I liked but nothing that I loved so I didn't pick anything up from here I can't lie, this charity shop overwhelmed me so much. There were like so many people in here and I was proper freaking out. There wasn't really anything I found either, but it's still nice to have a look around. I think the RSPCA charity shop is one of my favorites. I once saw an ABBA vinyl here for one pound, which just made it my favorite. They just got such cute little pieces and they even do like incense and stuff. And I just love looking around. I've stopped off at Costa for like a little lunch break. I got my favorite panini and I just got some water because I just wanted water. So far, it's been really unsuccessful and I'm kind of upset. I've been quite unlucky with all these charity shops. Like there's, there wasn't really anything that I found and that I loved. Oxfam is definitely my favorite charity shop. I feel like I've always been so lucky there. I always find the cutest pieces and I just love all the different sections. I love the fact that it's also organized in color. It's just so satisfying to me. I also love the back section where they literally just put a bunch of random things that you can just look at. I find that so cool. The last charity shop I'm going in, I had a gut feeling I wasn't gonna find anything in there because I never really do but I just feel like I needed to look in there and just have a little rummage around to see what I could find. But obviously I did come out empty handed. <laughs> I knew Oxfam would come in clutch, I actually got something. So I've pretty much done all the charity shops. I'm gonna look in the market. Don't really know why, I just like looking at, at different things, just random little bits. is on the way home my legs ache so bad so guys i'm back home and i'm just gonna do a quick haul like it's a very very small haul because i'm gonna say i was kind of disappointed like there was some really cute stuff but definitely charity shopping in the uk is such a hit or miss and most of the time it's a miss but i'll show you what i got anyway so first of all kind of random they were doing like free dvds for a pound and I was like, oh, I'm only going to get it if Friends of Benefits is there, which is one of my favourite films. Friends of Benefits was there, so I was like, I have to get two more movies. I got 21 Jump Street, which Connor will be so happy about. I can't wait to tell him. And I also got the Inbetweeners movie, because why not? So the only piece of clothing that I got was this, like, knit sweater. Even though we're kind of getting to summer, I was like, I have to get it. It's just so cute. Like it's actually stunning and it was only 4 99 and I think that's really reasonable. The last thing I got wasn't even from a charity shop. I literally went into Primark and got these. But these are sunglasses. I need to like build more of a collection of sunglasses. I don't know how I feel but I was like, you know what? Get me a pair of sunglasses. Why not? Like they, they're a bit weird but I thought, you know what? Might as well, then I've got so much choice. So I really hope you enjoyed this video and yeah please subscribe.